normally as mundane an investment as it gets. Gold has captivated the attention of the market lately for its seemingly logic-defying record rally in recent months. And now heads are turning toward a new, unlikely player in the gold market, wholesale retailer Costco. Seven's report founder Tom Essay explains the rally initially began late last year, as investors piled into a new refuge as the US dollar lost value and interest rate expectations dwindled before getting a further bump from renewed concerns in 2024 about the potential for lingering inflation. And despite the Costco mania, it's actually institutional investors and central banks, especially those coming from China, driving much of the surging demand for gold, as investors and bankers from China and other largely non-Western countries look to hedge against an economic downturn scenario while simultaneously lessening their dependence on the American dollar. The gold market is telling investors that inflation pressures could linger longer than the Federal Reserve would want. LPL Financial's chief economist Jeffrey Roach wrote in emailed comments Wednesday following the release of Mach's consumer price index data which revealed worse than anticipated inflation. Conventional wisdom has long pegged gold as a safe haven asset included in portfolios to protect against stock and bond losses associated with recessions, as concerns about the economy or geopolitical instability typically cause gold prices to go up. That makes the recent rally all the more strange, as stocks are trading at record valuations and experts largely think the US has avoided a full-blown recession this economic cycle. Gold prices actually fell slightly Wednesday amid a hotter-than-expected inflation report as yields for U.S. government bonds shot up and the dollar advanced, though gold is still considered a strong hedge against inflation given its long history of retaining value. The gold rally's concurrence with strong equity and cryptocurrency returns highlights the confounding environment facing investors in recent years, as long-held truths like stop losses accompanying a rapid rise in interest rates, have proven false, at least for now. Unlike stocks, bonds or other commodities with clearer use cases, gold derives its value from market perception of its worth, buoyed by its centuries-long history as a currency and show of wealth. It's been a brutal stretch for many gold miner stocks, and it's actually for almost precisely the same reason that gold prices are up in the first place. High interest rates and soaring prices. Mining is a capital-intensive business, meaning companies disproportionately rely on debt financing, causing their bottom lines to shrivel during high-rate periods, while higher energy and labor costs are also weighing on their performance, according to Ernst & Young. The biggest U.S.